<laughs> Magic Dance by uh, da- David Bowie, 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 Bowie from Labyrinth. Bowie, Bowie. Um, how are you feeling, Pete? Ow. Yeah, um, during that song, <laughs> Pete decided to lean back on his chair and collapse on the studio floor. It was very funny to us. No, can I just point out, the chair was malfunctioning because... Oh, it was the chair's fault. Because there was, uh, there was only two screws where four should have been. And so, when right. I, and so when I leant back, the front of the chair wasn't screwed to the thing. Ah. <laughs> so it was very funny. My legs got spread in the air and I hit my head on the wall, which... <laughs> are, you, uh, are you okay? Are you better as good as um, usual, or...? It's, I'm a little bit concussed. Pardon? I'm a little bit concussed. Oh, right. <laughs> um, so, yeah, um, uh, yeah. Anyway, did you um, enjoy, apart from that, did you enjoy the song? <laughs> that was a magic dance, wasn't it? It was, really? it was hell of a dance, yeah. <laughs> Not many people could do that. It was amazing. <laughs> Thanks, comedy genius. Shame this show isn't videoed. We maybe, we maybe, well, now we have discussed this, haven't we? For we our, have, won't for we? Our 50th, we either for our 50th or like a year on, which will be about the same sort of time anyway. Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, we were thinking of videoing the whole show and putting it on YouTube. Don't know what people would think about that. Oh, let us know. Drop us your hints. Tell us what you think. Drop us your hints. I don't know. Healthy hints. Healthy hints. Send us what you think. That makes your thoughts. Sense. Thoughts. That's you the go. one. Your hints. No, if they've got any hints, you know, like, uh... How know. to do good radio shows. Yes, that's always a good hint. Yeah. Um, how to floss properly. What are you implying? Um, armpit hair, armpit hair. Do you know, did you know that really long armpit hair makes men smell worse? So if you trim your armpit hair, you haven't got as much of the smell to stay on because there's nothing worse than a... Don't show me your armpit hair! How is it? Is it long? It, um... Your hand's in the way now. Oh, hang on. Like... Y- you're not too bad on the armpit Thanks. hair stakes. Yeah. When mine grows, it's long. Is it? I have to... Tr- and it's true, it smells. And there's nothing worse than someone who smells. You know smells. why it smells? Because of odour, body odour? Because, well, the sweat sort of lingers on, on the hair. On the hair, yeah. Because the sweat on its own doesn't smell. It's the hair that gives it its thing. Ah. I think it's like the, the, the bacteria in your hair or something like that. Is that why I can't bear it when people have sweated in a t-shirt and then it smells and then they put it on the next day and then the sweat goes through to the old sweat and it just smells disgusting. Maybe. I don't like that. Give over. Uh, yeah, it really puts me off actually, to be fair. How do we get talking about armpits? Um, because of handy hints. <laughs> Trim your armpit <laughs> hair. There's a handy hint. <laughs> Well, anyway, yes, yeah, so we might put the show on YouTube. <laughs> if you want to listen to our previous shows, including last week's show, which was your birthday show, Pete. Yes! Uh, go to www.youtube.com slash Carry On Friday, and all our previous shows are there. Do you know who's been listening to our previous shows, Pete? Barry White. <laughs> Isn't he dead? Yes, he is. From beyond the grave, he's tagging onto YouTube. <laughs> tagging onto YouTube. <laughs> Logging onto YouTube, surely. Who tagging on? on. Clicking I'll on. Do. I did it. No, my cousin, right? My cousin, Alex Davis. Hi, Alex. Hello, Alex. Um, is, is, uh, listen, he's currently in New Zealand. Ooh. He's been around the world. He went to Spain, then he went to South America, and all sorts. And now he's in New Zealand. What's he doing over there? He's, he's getting away for tax purposes. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, that? oh, really? Okay. <laughs> no. He's just doing a tour of the world. You know, he's been travelling. Actually, do yeah. Um, and he was listening to the shows, uh, and he very much enjoyed them. Thank so, you. Also, he's been asking. You know what he's been asking, Pete? Right. Wait, what? What? He's been asking. What happened to Klaus? Oh, Klaus the cleaner. Where did Klaus go? I don't know. He's a cleaner. He's, I don't know. We I should. D- we should maybe go and check and see if he's about. Do you want to see if he's there? Shall I? Shall I go now? Have, have a quick look. Hang on. Have I've a very. Just, quick I've just look. fallen off a chair. I know, but just very quickly. Honestly, we won't. We won't make this fast long. There you go. There goes Pete outside. Right, is he there, Pete? Is he? Is he there? Yes. Oh, here he is, coming, Klaus. Coming, coming. Yeah, hello. Oh, it's Klaus here. I just wanted to say hi to Alex. Was listening outside. Very good. Thanks, Klaus. Bye now. Bye, Klaus. He's going. He's oh. going. And he's gone. That was just for you, Alex. That last thirty seconds. Ow! <laughs> what have you done now? <gasps> Plastic thing under the table. I just smacked my knee. <laughs> oh, you, you poor little thing. <laughs> that really hurt. Did it? Yeah, it did. Oh, can we go to a song? I then? think it's right. Okay, well, for I'm you, really, Alex. I'm really sorry, Alex, to ruin your. Well, this song's kind of for him, right? Because obviously he's in New Zealand. Yeah. And the closest thing I've got to a song about New Zealand is "May It Be" by Enya because it was filmed over there for Lord of the Rings. No. Oh. It's called Australia. <laughs> <laughs> it's by the Maddox Street Preachers. Um, we play that next. We've got some feeder coming up along with all the usual stuff, so don't go anywhere. 
somewhere in the dark and nasty regions of Britain, where nobody goes, lies the seldom seen community of wonky Sodom. In this dank and uninviting place, the wonky Sodomites go about their daily business. But what is it they're getting up to? Who's a good boy? You're a good boy, aren't you? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Whoa, hold on there, young man. There, you're safe now, my fine little chap. Hey, what you do that for? You could have been mauled by that vicious bear. And thanks to my arrival on the scene, you can breathe easily. It, it, it was a chihuahua. Danger lurks around every corner, never forget that. And the only way to meet it is by hiding around the corner and waiting for me to help. Or by using a mirror and checking to see what's happening. It's all about the angles. Well, I suppose you could go back the way you came. Anyway, what's your name, young whippersnapper? Billy, who are you? And why are you wearing a daft outfit? Looks like you got your pants on outside your trousers. You, uh, haven't heard of me? Pants man? Ha 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 ha! No, you've clearly been brainwashed by the evil motherly overlords. For surely you've heard of... Weekend Dad! Um... No. Weekend Dad? Really? In the week, I am mild-mannered data entry clerk, Ryan Wilson. But on the weekend, I am Weekend Dad. Oh, right. But it's Friday. Uh, well, the weekend starts here, Billy. And you are lucky enough to have my attention for the whole weekend. But you're not me, Dad. I am a hero for dads everywhere. I am the poorly made attempts at food. I am the groin that is battered by badly aimed footballs. I am the delayed child support payment. I am Weekend Dad. Okay. So, Billy, what do you want to do this weekend? I don't know. Um, the circus. Oh, uh, Weekend Dad cannot afford the circus. How about... McDandy's? Nah. Um, bowling? Uh, Weekend Dad hurt his fingers rescuing children from wild, vicious bears. How about a ride in Weekend Dad's car listening to Weekend Dad's classic music? Yuck. No. Well, can you... Oh! Ah! Ah! Oh! Oh! oh, oh. oh. You got me dog back? Oh, wow! You really are a superhero! Thanks, mister! Uh, yes! Yes, I am! I'm now also pleased I'm wearing two pairs of pants. But now you're happy, it's time I appeased another sad and lonely child with my superpowers. Oh, no, I want to come with you! A uh, weekend dad doesn't need a sidekick. Well, what about for this weekend? I've already got a Spider-Man outfit. Really? Well, mm, I suppose this once. Come on then, Billy! To the Ford Escort Mobile! Yippee!